Hi Libra, how are you today? Just going to do a healing oracle card for you to meditate on while we do the three cards for mental and three cards for emotional reading. So what does Libra need to know today? On the healing, what does Libra need to know? Right, let's have a look please. Get clear. Get clear. So there's an aspect here, Libra, for clarification. Also, you can see she's reading information. So let's take a look at what really is going on. So on the mental side, what do Libras need to know today? That's really coming out, isn't it? It just wants to come out. <laughs> okay, so Princess of Winter. You have Princess of Winter. So there's an aspect here of new thoughts coming out, new decisions. It's also about being clear and precise about the clarity of the situation to move forward. Also, you have life experience. So if everything is kind of tumbling down and this big change is really coming about, the clarity that's definitely needed here is to find a way to realise that this change is always quite good. So what's brought us to this place today has been useful and now we're making a new way of deciding to go forth even though it might be a hard decision to make strength so this is why you're having the strength card today to give you that inner power being who you are to formulate how you can cope with these aspects now sometimes with this card it can be quite painful and other times it's quite a interesting time to release. So let's have a look emotionally at what's going on with Libra. Emotional for Libra emotions. Libra emotions. Okay. So, first card is Five of Summer. Five of Summer. So with this change that's just come about, or coming about, making the decision to not pay attention to the pain that it's caused. Paying attention now, perhaps, to a happier time where you can really find that strength to be able to move away move away to get the clarity of this situation so no one likes this situation of change but it does make you a stronger person and you'll be able to see that on a mental level here so with the sixth of autumn it's all about here this, this is a good card to have because it's all about receiving, receiving and giving. So because you've had this life experience, you'll be able to give new ideas to those around you as well as yourself. So I think you'll have tapped into what, what comes around, goes around kind of aspect. And it is a learning process, but it's also having the strength to be able to go, I accept that, I can move on. Last card for you is the Eight of Autumn. So there is more learning to be had. So in your situation, perhaps, for most of you, it's about learning on a practical level. So maybe there is more study to be had. And that's the inspiration. That's the start of things to come. 
So getting clarity what you need to learn from. Some of you may be going through a difficult time of a relationship breakup. Some of you. I don't think there's a lot going on, to be fair. I think this is more to do with pushing through a lot of hard work. Whether that be our careers, our finances, things like that. I don't think it's really got to do much with your relationship at all. But finding that strength to be able to go on when things around us, our environment and how we make money is really difficult. On, on a smaller level, just getting information and clarity is important. But you've got that with this. This is the start of new ideas, the start to go through. Winter is always a time of reflection and a pace. Even though the universe has thrown you into a tower situation, getting clarity, asking for help and just learning a little bit more about yourself and how you've dealt with the challenges thus so far. Okay, a little bit heavy but you're fine, you're absolutely fine. Okay, enjoy the rest of your day and we'll see you again later. Lots of love to you all.